Hola! Welcome to the report from Tiger Mountain. This is the New Mexico, Victoria. Welcome. We're going to discuss Victoria as the New Mexico tonight on the report from Tiger Mountain. All right, ladies and gentlemen, Victoria is in is in lockdown, and not complete lockdown. Certain suburbs um, all over uh, Victoria, uh, sorry, Melbourne, have been locked down, and uh, in different states. You know, um, I'm more worried about the postcode of 1984, if you know what I mean. But um, various other postcodes have been in lockdown, and also to the border with uh, South Australia and with New South Wales, which was open during most of this crisis, is now closed as well. So basically, um, Victoria has been turned into the New Mexico. We are basically uh, like the New Mexico of Australia, where the new uh, kind of wetbacks or whatever you want to call them, you know, we're the new pariahs or whatever. And there's talk, you know, of like Mexican, sorry, Mexicans. Well, yes, that's us now, I guess. But um, Victorians being smuggled across the border. Maybe we're going to need a wall soon. They're going to have to get Donald Trump down here to build a wall between like Victoria and New South Wales to keep us damn pesky Victorians out of New South Wales. So, you know, with this talk of smuggly thin in trucks, maybe we're going to swim the Murray, you know, to get over to New South Wales. There's all kinds of mischief going on and all kinds of nonsense. So, you know, the Queensland border is, is going to be checking trucks to see if it contains Victorians. Obviously, the New South Wales border closes. And, you know, then, of course, we've got, you know, um, Dictator Dan in charge of uh, the New Mexico, which is Victoria. So, you know, it's a terrible state of affairs. Obviously, uh, various um, postcodes are in lockdown, as I mentioned before. But look, I'm going to predict right here today that by the time this comes out, the whole state will be in lockdown, in complete lockdown. It's probably going to happen this afternoon, and if not this afternoon, by the end of this week. So, uh, but probably by the time you see this video, we're going to be in full lockdown again. Um, I don't know how long that will be, but if we are going to lock down again, it should be fucking hard lockdown. We should lock down for two or three fucking weeks where we can only go to the supermarket and back and just finish this fucking thing so that it's over. And, you know, but then, you know, this is the whole thing. I mean, there's something about this crisis and, you know, it reminds me of the war on terror because the war on terror was never meant to be ended and it still hasn't ended. It's meant to continue. And that's what I worry is going on with this virus. This virus, they don't want to get rid of it, particularly when you have a globalist and or Chinese agent uh, running a state or a government. You know, like, you know, you've got different states and governors in America who are definitely fanning the flames of COVID and you have one here in Victoria with Dan Andrews. They don't want this to end. They want it to continue. They want this to, they always talk about the new normal because that's what they want. They want this. This is the future. And you know, it's not only that this is the future, they are constructing it. You know, and there's also this case, an interesting article came out about a month ago about tests that were going to the UK. You know, there's people when you get the test, that on the test itself was COVID-19 in 1 in 20 cases. So that's maybe how they're giving it to people. So whenever a society begins to cure itself, oh, long and come and you would better just test to make sure it's gone. Uh, in comes the new infections. So this, you know, we're under attack, ladies and gentlemen. We're in a bio war, most likely, with China. Um, this is a shocking situation. And, you know, Victorians are the new Mexicans. It's utterly ridiculous. Victorians are like refugees at the moment. Many of them are trying to escape Victoria. I mean, to be honest, I want to join them. If I could get up to Queensland right now, I'd spend like two or three months up there in the sun so I don't have to basically lock down in my own home in the middle of fucking winter um, and, and be miserable for two or three months. I could be up in, up in, up in Queensland writing a new film script. So Mexicans, are, uh, sorry, Mexicans, I keep calling Victorians Mexicans. It's already sunk in. Uh, Victorians are like Mexicans. It's utterly ridiculous. And again, this is all planned. It's all part of the pandemic and it's all fucking ridiculous. And we reject it all here at the report from Tiger Mountain. Free Australia, free Victoria, and get rid of this COVID bullshit. Let's get back to the traditional normal, ladies and gentlemen. That's what we want. And that's it from the report from Tiger Mountain. Thank you for listening.